Hello students, how have you been today? You are okay? Our topic for today, that's Unit 11, NGOs. Reading part, Job Advertisements. Before I proceed my session, I would like to introduce you the main objectives of this lesson. Just you read some job advertisements. While you are reading advertisements, what kind of reading strategy do you use? That is a main issue. And learn some words to describe skills and personal qualities. Different organizations need different kinds of what? Qualities at the same time? Professional qualifications. That's all the main topic and issues of today's reading activity. Before the presenter or you are going to read the text, reading is by itself is an individual activity. So hopefully you read the text that is job advertisement is and then you'll say a lot of suggestions or opinions about different kinds of job advertisements which are posted in many parts of the country. Now, before you are going to read the text, please give your opinion about these questions. Look at three job advertisements. Where do you find advertisements like? Look at those ad advertisements. In what way these advertisements have been written by these different organizations? Are they all the same or different? What makes them similar and what makes them different? What are the words, the way that they are using to express in order to advertise their organization. That's why all these things should be considered. Read the advertisements and complete the notes below for each one. Look at the table below.
Very nice. Type of organization. Is it energy or international energy or? Is that the UN office? Is that local organization? Right? Or is that indigenous organization? Government organization? Etc. Type of organization. This means as it. The job title. The job title. What kind of person do they need? What kind of person does the organization want to employ in that position? Job title. Maybe what? That is uh, a teacher, an accountant, a manager, a lawyer, etc. All this should be considered. Just look at in all parts, job A, job B, and job C. Our responsibilities. What kind of responsibility does the organization expect from that employer? It should be written there. So you have to take responsibilities, the duties that you have to commit so as to satisfy the needs of what? The organization. A skills required. What kind of skill do you have? Skill of what? It's maybe that's computer. A skill of what? It's maybe that is driving a car. Right? A skill of what? A skill of maintaining electric. A skill of maintaining computers. Different skills might be asked by the organization. Which organization okay, asks this kind of skills? Location of a job is, yeah, or jobs have set their location, the place of the location. Location of job, where is it? Is it Addis Ababa? Where is it? Is it Gambella? Where is it? Is it Adama or Jimma? Right? Etc. Very nice. I'm sure that the text is so easy. Hopefully, yeah, you can check what you have done through the reading passage. It's available. As I told you that, don't forget that you have to use scanning strategies very important here now. That's why it doesn't ask you any scheming form. It doesn't ask you any idea. It only needs what? A specific information about each job descriptions. So based on that, you will complete this table without any difficulties. Very nice. You see? How we do like this? Very interesting. These are the possible answers. Job A. Job A. What they need is that assistant supply officer. The organization. What kind of organization is that? The organization is a small UN agency. The type of organization. Job A. Job B, B is that is small NGO. That is non governmental organization. Small NGO. It may be that's domestic indigenous organizations, maybe. Job C, national NGO. The indigenous one in the context of what ethiopia okay the position what that they need is that assistant supply officer they need the one who is qualified with what supplying different goods in different ways and then job b office administrator they need office administrator that means you want resource officer Job C, definitely you are right. Have you said field officer? Very good. That's it. Interesting. And job A, the responsibility. The responsibility that is expected from job A. Supervise arrival and dispatch of goods, places, orders with suppliers. This is the duty, the responsibility that to be expected from the applicant. The one who wants to fit to this organization, he has to 
uh, involve or just make himself so as to complete all these activities. Job be manage office. What they need is that his responsibilities managing the office in what way? In a good manner. Yeah. Without making any conflict, right? He has to manage everybody who is working in that organization in a, a good manner. Job C, gather information. Yeah, this organization needs the one who is gathering information. So as to perform data, etc. And the one, the skills. What kind of skills do they need? A. Job advertisement A needs what? Computer skill. You have to have good computer skill, definitely. Job B, definitely, this computer. They all need computer skill, except C needs what? Driving license. The location, when you come to the location, job A, that is Addis Ababa, job B, Harar, job C, that is Addis Ababa Seb. To conclude my lesson, I would like to remind you very important issue that we have seen so far in the reading activity. That was job advertisement. So in that sense, while you are reading any advertisements, you have to use your reading strategies. We have seen different kinds of strategies in order to understand any reading text. For our purpose, scanning is a very important type of strategy that we use to identify date, place, and that is time, location, etc. That's all we have for today. Until we meet next session, goodbye students.